punch and die clearance. For detail please visit my YouTube channel and please subscribe. Die clearance. Die clearance is the distance between a punch's cutting edge and a die button's cutting edge. It's the amount of extra space that's needed to provide the leverage to shear and break the stock material to create a hole. The percentage per side relates to the thickness of the workpiece material. For detail please visit my YouTube channel and please subscribe. die clearance determined. An industry rule of thumb is for die clearance to be about 10% of the punched material's stock thickness. However, it's important to know further research has proven that increasing that percentage up to 11 to 20% can greatly reduce the strain on punch tooling. Factors that affect die clearance. These are the main factors determining how much die clearance is required for safe, consistent, high quality stamping operations. Punch and workpiece material type, punch and workpiece material thickness, punch and workpiece material hardness, punched hole size and geometry and tolerancing, anticipated tool life. Example die clearance values. Why is calculating punch and die clearance necessary? Having the correct die clearance will help you get a cleaner, more accurate result and ensure the quality of the stamped part, reduce the possibility of galling and adhesive wear, extend the life of your precision tools. On the flip side, having an incorrect die clearance calculation could result in excessive burrs, out of tolerance holes, cracks and breaks in punches, buttons, and other precision tools, increased tonnage and punch force requirement. For detail please visit my YouTube channel and please subscribe. For detail please visit my YouTube channel and